we, we're going to be using two boards, uh, two Xiao ESP32C3 boards. This is the receiver uh, board, okay? And uh, I'm going to connect, okay, uh, this module, okay, the DF player mini to the uh, receiver uh, board, just like that. Boom. <laughs> Uh, a little bit of uh, a little bit of t now uh this wire uh this uh jumper wire uh is connected to the uh, rx of the module okay and uh, the other end i'm going to connect to the um um gpio3 of the uh of the receiver uh, board okay and then the other wire uh, tx uh, from tx okay to the uh, gpio guess what two <laughs> great okay t sorry uh, now uh, this is the vcc the vcc of course, it's going to um, Xiao ESP32 C3 uh, 5 volt pin, okay? 5 volt pin. And then uh, we need to ground the two grounds, you know, of the DF player mini. So we ground them, okay? So in the way uh, these two ground pins, they're going to ground, okay? Great. Okay, um, I think I'm done. I think we're, we're, we're done here. Um, okay. That's beautiful, guys. So now, let me insert the uh, SD card into the EF um, Player Mini. Just for this moment, just for demonstration. No, not 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 demonstration. The, this is real, real. Okay, okay. Uh, that's the um. Uh, that's the transmitter uh, board, okay? Okay, uh, with here a push button and uh, we're gonna be forming a uh, input pull-up, okay? Uh, so, this is, okay, the digital pin uh, D D10, okay? Um, and uh, of course the uh, other pin of the push button will be attached to the uh, ground of the uh, Xiao ES ESP 32C3 board. Of course we need to connect the, the uh, 20 ohm 1 watt speaker. So the, the word wire is going to speaker 1 and the black wire uh, to speaker um, two. That's beautiful, guys. Very, very, very beautiful. Okay, as you can see. Great, we made it. That's great. Okay, well, of course, the cable to upload, you know, that's, uh, the sketches for transmitter board and the uh, receiver board. Okay, now um, let me show you something. Okay, um, now we need to create, okay, to convert a text to um, to speech, okay, to audio. So do that. You, you, you can choose the voice, okay, and then you provide the capture code, okay, which is on your 
right side okay then you you click on convert to speech and then you yeah you do this stuff and you press ok you you, you click ok no uh, we we press again we click again again then hello world we can hear yes. our hello world audio then you download it okay hello world download the audio okay great so great so don't forget to insert your sd card into your pc so you can uh, paste into on tweet on tweet the uh, the audio okay like that so now we're done we go to back to the uh, our laptop okay you should change the name of your audio to zero zero one okay just like that and um so the file system of your sd card should be fat32 or fat16 okay and uh, you also need to uh, format okay your sd card before using it okay so just like that when you're done for formatting you should paste the audio okay into your sd card okay in your sd card okay now you remove the sd card when you're done when you're done then you insert the sd card into your df player mini so this is the uh, schematic for the uh, re receiver board and uh, this one for the uh, transmitter board of course the code okay so this is the uh, the code for the uh, transmitter board okay uh, this is the code for the uh, transmitter this is the push button okay and uh, this is the address the mac address of the of the receiver board okay and the uh, input pull up okay is the uh, d zero pin okay everything is here okay uh, so okay guys so this is the function the uh, digital read because we we, we, we are using push button so we need to read and uh, this is the function that is going to send okay uh the data to the uh, receiver um board so uh, on, on this side with the um receiver code uh, so you need to install okay that df uh, okay what about okay this library okay so um, yeah that's the uh, trans the receiver code okay and uh, that's the function that is going to receive the data coming from the transmitter code okay this function and uh, great beautiful 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 Okay, now to know uh, to know the uh, the MAC address of the um, uh, of the receiver code, I, I don't think you need a, a, a specific code. Okay, any specific code, you 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 just need to download. Okay, first. Okay, the receiver code. And then on the output, you're going to see. Okay, so we choose the the board. Okay, Xiao ESP thirty two C three board. Then tools, uh, we choose the the port. Then we download the program. So when the uh, download is done, 
you go to the output okay on the uh, output we, we we're gonna see the uh, mac address of the transmitter um, the, of the re receiver code okay guys um we're gonna wait so when upload as uh, so some problem here so we do do, do, do do that again okay so when we're, we're done uploading uh, we're gonna you you will see on on the uh, output wait a few seconds so on the uh, shiao we don't need to press the boot uh, button okay so here when the uh, upload is done you will see if you if you scroll up okay if you continue scrolling up you will see the uh, mac address of the receiver code okay yeah this is the uh, mac address okay and you cap okay this mac address and uh, you put this uh, the mac address here okay the first number these are exa 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 number okay this one is this one this one is this one I think I missed something. Okay. Anyway, so you just do that, and uh, yeah. After that, you we, uh, we are using two Shell ESP thirty two C three boards. Okay, guys. So now testing time. So don't forget to subscribe and Hello, hit the uh, bell icon. Stay tuned Hello, for more vi uh, videos, and I see you in the next move. Hello, world. Bye bye.